Good morning, or afternoon, or evening, wherever you are in the world. My name is Robert Keith. I'm the Hopeful Wanderer. And today's video, this one anyway, is about economics. We're going to talk about the economics of a caveman. The, sim the high, high vibration, high dimensional focused human being. Supply and demand. That's usually how it just distribution, the supply chain that we're dealing with, interestingly enough. For example, right now, I'm in the Sonoran Desert. It's beautiful, it's quiet, and it's free. And I can be here for 14 days. Okay, 13 days. 12, I don't know, whatever. I've been here a couple. But the point is, I can stay here, and in staying here for these 14 days or 12 days or whatever, I don't, my supply will be limited and it will be drained but at the same time I'm not extending my supply for example I'm not using oil or gas excuse me so I'm not using gas right now so I'm stationary which saves me on fuel and it saves me on money and it saves me on some time so I can focus and work on some art which I was gonna do some more today I got I have a couple more canvases that I can start fresh with plus I have a bunch I still have to kind of finish because I do a lot of background work and then I kind of Try to put something soft in the foreground. You can go back to my past volumes and see one of my, I have a couple of art galleries I posted. So you can kind of get an idea of what I do. If you're interested in that kind of thing. But <clears throat> yeah, economics, just how much do you want to put out? How much do you expend? How much energy do you expend in this world? What do you need? This, this whole lockdown, whatever, this whole shutdown and everybody forcing everybody in their caves or whatever, so to speak has made you see what you need, what you, what you, what's important. That's the idea of the Great Awakening is the, what, it, what focus on, what to focus on, right? It's like you, you either get up the way, you either got the wake up call or you didn't. Plain and simple. Either you stopped and you got that aha moment where you're like, something's got to change because this, if, if it's this unstable and this fragile, they need to work on some shit, right? And you don't want to be part of this mess. So it's understandable. Who does, right? Nobody wants to be a part of confusion and chaos. We want peace and comfort and, and, and you know, harmony, basically. So, yeah, economics. How much are you expending? So, I'm not saying just sit on your ass and don't do nothing. But at the same time, watch where you're going, watch what you're doing, watch what you're eating, watch what you're, you know, make it count. If you're going to use fuel, go to someplace beautiful and relax. <coughs> Excuse me. But anyway, that's it. Thought that I'd throw out this video real quick. Inspired to. But hopefully it helps. It gets you thinking. Gives you a little hmm. Anyway. I love you. God loves you. And the universe is still really hot on you. So anyway. Have fun with that. Have a wonderful day. And yeah. Enjoy your surroundings, people. Enjoy your surroundings.